After going through your COVID, I think one thing that you realize is that you can't necessarily prepare for it. It's just something that you have to kind of roll with, you know, roll with the punches. Last year was kind of a little bit of a mess with uh, starting the first day that actually was supposed to be our shutdown. So we didn't have a lot of practice time together all summer. But, um, you know, this year I feel a lot more prepared scheme-wise. And most importantly, we have, you know, we built great relationships with this team and we really care about one another. The team chemistry under Coach Cameron is great. You know, I feel like we're a group of brothers that, uh, that really care for each other. You know, he does a good job of making us do stuff together as a team on and off the field. We do a good job of keeping each other accountable. He, he makes sure to let us know to keep each other accountable. It's just been really good. It's a really good experience under him. The team chemistry has been good. We just got to get up and get out. And Coach Cameron thinks of us more of a family than a team, really. And I believe he really do and truly love us as a family. Our team prepared this year by starting in June with great, great attendance all through the summer. Uh, kids worked hard. Um, and they showed up every day. We didn't have to go hunt anybody. We didn't have to go find them. Football is a very hard sport to play. If it, you know, it wasn't hard for everybody to be playing it. You know, that's one thing that these guys know. Something that Coach Cameron has kind of taught us is the next man up. So, you know, with COVID, there's adversity there. And, you know, when somebody gets sent home, somebody gets hurt, you know, somebody can't play, you know, it's just the next man up. And I think this team has done a very good job of um, dealing with that. The team has been doing great. We've been working hard, practicing hard, especially during seven on seven. So you get a lot of reps. Um, our practice structure is that we try to get as re many reps as possible in a little bit of time. So, you know, our guys really, really work for about an hour and 45 minutes to two hours. Um, not a lot of standing around. So I think that separates us from teams in the sense of conditioning. And uh, we're really just trying to get after it and try to play really, really fast and physical football. Obviously, after coming off a great year last year, you know, winning regions are our biggest goal. Um, making the playoffs is always something that um, is expected here at Padilla, and um, I think that's the goal as usual every year. We lost 19 seniors from last year's team. Yeah, our biggest challenge this year as a football team is just inexperience. A lot of guys that are getting their first reps Friday night next week. Um, so there's a lot of un uh, things that we're not really sure what the results will be. So you say like it's a lot unexpected and we're not really sure what's going to happen. But like I said, I think with repetition, we'll get more confidence. And as the season goes on, we'll continue to progress and hopefully hit our stride come region play. Working with the offensive linemen, because you know they're younger than everybody else. And we have a very heavy sophomore class coming from last year. Getting them under the lights Friday nights, I mean, it's just different than practice Monday through Thursday. I mean, and that's that's the thing these guys got to realize when they get out there. It's it's a whole different ball game. Uh, our team is defined by its hard work. Uh, they show up every day and uh, always do what's told of them and do it with 100% effort. The thing that defines this team is work ethic. I mean, we go out every day, we hit, we go in the weight room, go on the field and just work. I mean, that's, that's just been ingrained in us since we were little. I feel um, really good about the game tonight. I think it'll be a great challenge for the team. You know, we'll be able to really see um, what we need to work on, you know, as a team and, you know, you know what we can do this year. So. Uh, you can expect a lot from us tonight. You know, there's going to be a lot of energy. Uh, a lot of excitement, you know, we're just, we're ready to play. I mean, we've been, we've been working all summer. We're just excited to get out on the field and just let our uh, hard work show off.